And on through the Gs Bowl outfield. It's Finn Allen. First runs for the Southern Brave and it'll come via the way of a Finn Allen boundary. Just searching a little bit too. He's not got all of that. That was quite high on the bat, but there's no fielder patrolling the deep. Now, big appeal and given. He makes the breakthrough. Whenever he has ball in hand, magic happens. What a change of ends. A quicker ball, 88 miles an hour, and just gets the fine tickle through to the keeper, Shaheen Shah, Afridi is magic on a superstar. I don't think deep cover, even with the pace of Glenn Phillips, is going to cut that off. Beautifully strokes away, and Vince opens his account. Yeah, found the gap. Not as pretty as some of the shots that James Vince has in his bag, but just as, effect as effective. That's manoeuvre beautifully. Really clever stuff from James Vince. Just shuffling across the crease ever so slightly to the offside and working the ball into space. Flayed away from Allen. Races, scorches the turf on its way to the deep cover boundary. Delivery, so that one that comes in, that can be awkward for some. He just gets the hands high and drills it. In the air for a small amount of time. Hands on head. But the ball, yet again, finds its way to the boundary and now slipping through the gears of the Southern Brave. Playing short. And with that extra little bit of pace, Harris Ralph has a wicket. Allen has struggled a little bit for form of late. He looked good today. Yeah, again, that extra bit of pace causing problems for the Southern Brave. Not too dissimilar to Devon Conway. Got him. This has been a wonderful performance with the ball by the Welsh Fire so far. The home side under pressure. First ball shot James Vince has played all evening, just looking to go across the line. David Payne was on target. Yeah! Harris Roth with an exhibition of pace bowling here yeah, at the GS Ball. 89 miles an hour. And they've been on target, they've been full fast and straight. Goes full. He's very strong in that area, usually Harris Ralph, but deploy finds a way through. A much needed boundary. 52 now from 45. On his crease this time around, not moving his feet. And it's David Willey that gets the big fish of Tim David. Yeah, really good bowling that by David Willey. Batter who doesn't use his feet a lot, minimal movements, and you can just see he's stuck on the crease there. No idea where that went. What a catch, what a catch, a lot of work to do. It was in the air for a while, but David Willey just lost where he was for a moment. That is an excellent grab. David Willey, a man who's definitely got good hands. Yeah, he does really well in the end there. Luke Wells was just in the vicinity as well, but in no position to play the shot. He varies his pace. David Payne. Just picked off. Just clipped leg side. Beautiful timing. They need a partnership of note here. Hey! Oh, go on. It may have just kept down a little bit. Rulof van der Merwe has done an excellent job. Paces out of the game. Bounced a little lesser than he thought. A little lazy into the shot. Wasn't committed into the short ball. Didn't get into a great position. Rule off Van der Merwe, being the experienced man that he is, gets his first wicket for the day. Oh, 
Hazard, well picked up, direct hit. Is that Cornwall? The umpire's gone upstairs, but this doesn't look good. An extra cover. There's always a tight run, but to David Willey's left-hand side is a left-arm thrower. And the direct hit is normally trouble for the batter. It's a fantastic bit of fielding. Straight down the ground, that is Jordan at his best. He says enough is enough. Now let's put some runs on the board. Big six. Well, free hit. And he's got the connection. Not perfect, but enough. Picks that deep cow. And mid on boundary. Excellent. Well, Van der Merthe around the wicket. Oh, no, it's gone. He was nearly in line, David Willey, but it had too much momentum. And another six, Chris Jordan on fire. So 100 up off 83 balls. And he's gone again, this time leg side, and he beats both fielders, comes towards the pod. And Chris Jordan. Low full toss, the bowlers now have been put under pressure. It's not coming out right. And Chris Jordan has another freebie that he exposed the stumps. Well, he's tried to go and do exactly that and dart it leg side, but this time it goes into the arc of Jordan. Another six. Chris Jordan can. Has he got a tickle on it? Has he got a tickle on it? It looks like it's running away. And confirmation of the four that brings up Chris Jordan's first 50 in the 100. Chipped. Is there a fielder underneath it? Oh no, it's a drop. It's a drop. It's Luke Wells coming in from the boundary. Trying to hit leg stump. Oh, he's got a bit of length and it's enough to work with the Southern Brown Brave. The Southern Brave crowd are going crazy, even. Oh, wow, oh, wow, oh, wow. That was all hands. Just saw the left and swatted. Of the first innings. He drills it straight. There is no one out. Remember, a field out was brought in that provides opportunity. And Chris Jordan walks up 70, not out, from 32 balls. And this is what he did in that first game. David puts down a sitter. Oh, it's a beauty. He got a first ball of the other night. And now after the wide down the leg side, he gets another. Craig Overton's form with the new ball continues. That's a lovely piece of bowling. And a simple catch by Conway. Movement early on, creative. What a way to start the innings. First five balls are done and 12 is on the board. Picks this up with disdain and dispatches it over the boundary for six. He's really been exposing his stumps with the stance that he has at the moment, Eskenaz. Wells will continue with the attack. It's just what's required at this stage. Keep going. Top edge flying away. That's what happens. Luck stays on your side. Goes up a long way. Get your taller man in place. And that's why you get your taller man. If it's not Tim David, it's Craig Overton. They're not out of it quite yet. He got a lovely 50 the other day going well today but this one looking to go over long on straight into the hands of Craig Overton simple catch taken beautifully played beautifully played and beautifully placed Overton with the desperation they'll probably have a look at that brilliant brilliant work behind the stumps and brilliant work from Ray and Ahmed 
the spin, he got a little bit of bite from the surface. Eskenazi stepping out, pulls the ball short a bit, and a simple stumping to Devon Conway. Good cricket here from Southern Brave, picking up their third wicket. Yeah. First ball slightly short, Glenn Phillips pulls it away to the boundary. Finds the gap, finds the boundary. They are still ticking over. Tickled, beautifully tickled there by Tom Abel. Relatively tidy starts around the wicket. Starts with a slower ball and it is drilled straight into the hands of Craig Overton. That is the wicket the Southern Brave are looking for. On to make something happen here, George Garton. Change of pace. The two balls remaining and a thick outside edge. It just races away, quick surface here and a welcome boundary for the Welsh fire. Flicked away, has he got the distance? He doesn't, it's taken! Oh! Comfortable catch, down a deep square. I just think in his mind he'd got this. Well, that's going to help. That's going to help big time. Picked up beautifully. Scythe away for a maximum. Willie's first. It's gone high. Has it gone far enough? Oh, it certainly has for David Willie. Stuart Broad said that this isn't over yet, and Willie agrees. Over to Ben Green has gone high. And far enough. Tantalised fielder out at wide long on. And Green is winning this battle. Length ball, flat batted, straight back. You sort of know his cues. Hammer down again, but chance of a catch. This time, the bowling Somerset player wins the battle. Disappointed with that, actually. Overton goes a little bit wider but still in the slot high in the air should be caught should be a seven brave win he takes the catch it was so well judged and you can see with the crowd's reaction how close David Willey was to winning it for the fire as it is Seen a fantastic game. Tamal Mills goes into leg pace on David Willey, aiming leg side, top edges it. And there's a bit of a, a relief in that smile. Probably just got a little bit further away from him than he was hoping for. You want to take those right by your eyes. But he held his nerve. The celebrations, Mills delighted. Had a great night.